So I heard you guys were looking for a tent. Well, you don't have to look very much further. I'm going to show you the best way to capture a tent. And to do that, first, we need the right location. The apartment of Dubkey. Now here's what I discovered. I found multiple tents. I have eight so far. All on my own. And there's a method to it. I'm sure you've seen the videos, even for Dubkey, about, oh, just go into the big row of apartments. Go up and down, and eventually, after you search every single room ever, you'll find a tent. The reason I didn't like that is because I did it. After doing it for so dang long, I, I realized that after finding only two tents in about six hours, that this was not the way to do things. So, I thought to myself, how could I improve this? Well, I noticed by researching and from my own experience where tents usually spawn. Tents spawn in pretty much every part of the apartment except for these walkways right here. I also discovered that the only times I've ever found a tent, personally, is in this tenant right here. Either one of these uh, three rooms, one, two, and three. The second area is in this tenant, one and two. And the balcony, of course, respectable. Now, I found them in th these areas just by searching through over and over. And I got to thinking, well, is there a way I could find them easier? Because, come on, six hours and two tenths, that's a no-go. What if I could see them all the rooms and all the balconies all at once? So I got to thinking how I could have managed that. And I got to looking around, and eventually I came to Dubkey. All I got to do is get a bird's eye view. Now let's go to the top. This is the method. You go to the top of one of these apartments in Dubkey. This one or the one right over. All you have to do is come very close. You can go into escape and this is the menu and change your settings to a lower field of view if you want so you can zoom better. And if you zoom in even more, you can see pretty much everything. Now this only covers half the apartments and, and while it is true that uh, tents can spawn in the other rooms, covering half plus a little change, which is the rooftops, and I have confirmed from my own experience that they spawn the rooftops, allowed me to find one tent approximately every 13 minutes. So what we're going to do is we're going to test out my theory right now. We're going to come over to this corner, and then we're going to do, do the scanning technique. Pretty much we just go up and down each row. So I'm going to start from the left side, and you see uh, if you can scan with me. If you find a tent, Tell me, and if I find a tent, I'll tell you I found one and see if you can pick it up too. Go ahead and see if you can find one. Tent spot. Okay. Good. See if you can find. Alrighty. Yep, got it. It's quite obvious. Yeah. I'm gonna see if I can hit it. I don't think I will, but I'm gonna try, goddamn. And tell me right before you're about to fire. Oh fuck. Yeah. Aha! It would have hit it. Oh, you hit, did you hit that beam? Did you see that? Holy shit. Oh my god. <laughs> that was... It, from my angle, it would have hit it. That is fucking nuts. Oh, there shit. There we go. Nice. Nice. I just checked Daisy DP. That's like a yeah. 42, 43 meter distance right Ooh. there. Yeah. And a bow is like, effective at like 20 meters, so... Yeah. I think that's a pretty good shot. Let's go collect our prize. I just remembered something kind of important. We never... Do you remember which apartment it's in? We, we never counted. No, that was really stupid of we us. We never counted! <laughs> Get back up there! We were way up. too eager. Four, five, six, seven. Seventh floor. Nine, ten, eleven. It's the seventh floor, and it's the fifteenth window okay. from the left side. Another little tip. When we get up the ladder, we start on the fourth floor. So this mm -hmm. is the fifth. Oh, right. Okay. And the seventh. And voila! Yes. Here it is. I hit it! I oh. hit it! Look at this! I know! I know I could tell from back there that you hit it. <laughs> That's pretty amazing. <laughs> you see this arrow? That, sh that should have hit the tent. That yeah. was my first arrow. Yeah, yeah, this is actually the first tent I've ever found in Daisy. Now you can find many more with this system. While I do prefer Dubkey, and I do prefer the one method I showed you, this isn't the only one out there. There's apartments on the other side here. They're smaller, but with, considering the tent's size, which you saw, 
they can still peek over the edges of the, of the windows. So with this, I invite you all to experiment with the tips. You could go, instead of the one apartment I went to, you can go to the other apartment. You'll get more vision on this side over here, but this one will be lacking. It's all user preference. And remember, always check the rooftops. Seriously, I found two tents on the rooftop that I would have missed otherwise. And that's about it. As I was saying, do not go aiming down the sight. The bow has no sight, so it's very hard. However, stay in first person or third person, and you'll be able to see your desired effect. Just aim by the white dot. When you pull back your string, and you do not wish to fire, press R, and you will immediately redock the arrow.